Hi everyone, today I'm going to uh, introduce a new software as a service, um, a website which you can use for taking attendance of uh, your students while you are, um, you know, set apart from uh, the students or you are remotely, if you are remotely control your classroom. So I, I'm not claiming that this is an automated thing but you should have to do it manually but we can record it and everyone in the in your college or your superior can see uh, the attendance that you have marked even the students can also see when the parents if you can if you want to include the parents the parents can also see the attendance and another benefit of this is again you can send free sms you can send free email to the students concerned and you can send the report as well and this is absolutely free if you want to donate to the website creator you can donate from one dollar to as much you can so this is the advantage of uh, uh, this particular uh, uh, website see the website name is myattendancetracker.com so this is the website actually this is the landing page and uh, there is an option called the sign up options you can see the features over here mobile attendance um, software mobile attendance are there so you can download it from uh, you know play store so sign up you have to sign up so you have to give your details i have a um, i mean like i'm already a member so i'm logging in so this is the dashboard that you get i don't have a students or a classes i have assigned so step one by one i will introduce you first is again upgrade button so the amount dollar 10 per month you can choose your own amount here so as i said you can start with uh, you know one dollar one dollar per per month and uh, it's again a donation part and the web creator has created this website for his wife to take her, her uh, students attendance no need of uh, buying erp systems for taking attendance this is again a marvelous software you know for uh, taking attendance and it is free of cost you can cut cost after this corona season uh, you can cut cost by using this uh, myattendancetracker.com so take attendance you cannot take attendance without any classes or uh, students so first you have to go to uh, uh, no um, import or you have to type the entire student's name details everything so stu next button is students so there will be a once you click on students you will get a students list and add student classes you'll get a class list and add classes you can add classes if uh, you know have an example human resource you can add human resource classes and uh, you can add the uh, user of uh, human resource classes see the user means the faculty the faculty can track the attendance okay you can add parents then grades so grade level so if you have any parameter in your college you can uh, give that parameter uh, in grade level grade scales etc so next one is uh, invoice invoice list if anything fees payment anything you can you can add over here then uh, there is another very uh, what we called as uh, unique feature is uh, you know mailing system same as like um, you no know, gmail or uh, outlook so you can compose a mail here you can compose a mail here once you have uh, your students list definitely email id will come before importing students we have to create class class list so add class so hrm hrm so when your classes falls monday wednesday friday so add class so it is added so after creating the class you have to import students list so take tools import export so go to students you know you can see uh, we have created a class here right HRM that uh, that will be visible in this column 
if you have created more than one class every class will be visible over here and you have to select the class you have to select it and you have to take uh, you have to import the contacts of students so you can see class students user parents so if you have created csv file for everything that would be nice instead of uh, you know entering each and every contact so i have created a csv file for students even email id also i have created i am not giving email id right now so i am importing only students name yeah so 24 students were uploaded i will show you how to create user so before that you have to create class list have an example marketing sunday monday wednesday friday add class I'm adding it then go to user 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 list so you have to give uh, the marketing faculty name then email ID password you can create and you can assign as a class admin marketing one see and add user okay done so ram has been added next one you have to assign class to mr ram so take uh, mass action select the entire students add to class marketing one go so now you have assigned uh, this 24 students to that class same like if you have more students in different classes you can do same like that the other faculty can also take attendance okay then next simple step is again take attendance you can make a class attendance sheet for a subject within one minute and you can start taking attendance you know? see there are three uh, parameters present absent and tardy tardy means late so present absent you can give uh, you can take the attendance so we cannot say that uh, students will be genuine while you are taking zoom classes or you are taking classes remotely so what you can do is again you can uh, take attendance more than one time that is again ending beginning in the middle you can send uh, a google doc form see i have uh, done i have taken attendance demo so today is 14th you can see 15 percent uh tardy is one late is one and absent is eight it's very easy to make uh, those things next one is <clears throat> reports if you want to download reports so daily attendance sheet okay so class attendance class monthly attendance so if you want to take uh, daily attendance sheet So include attendance data you have to change it include attendance data on 14th for hrm class so it is downloaded daily attendance so you can send it to the students as well see the attendance sheet is ready and you can send it to the students or you can send it to the hod as well Hope you understood how to create an attendance sheet for a subject and how to take an attendance and generate attendance sheet.